In The Force Awakens, Snoke was never actually physically present, instead choosing to hide away in the darkness of what we now know is the unknown regions of space, which is yet to be explored by the beings explored thus far in the Star Wars mythos. Still though, many searched for the location of Supreme Leader Snoke, as he grew to be one of the major threats of the New Republic, and would prove this threat valid once he succeeded in destroying the entirety of the Hosnian system. Still though, after this major move, Snoke opted to remain in an unknown space, as he feared coming into physical contact with anyone due to his intense vulnerabilities. It was because of this that Snoke still remained hidden. In The Last Jedi, we discover that Snoke's base of operations is within his massive Mega Star Destroyer, the Supremacy, which serves as a major base for the First Order, even beyond Starkiller Base. In the visual guide for The Last Jedi, we learned exactly where an unknown space Snoke was hiding away within the Supremacy, and how he managed to stay hidden for so long with such a massive ship. This is what the visual guide says concerning Snoke and the Supremacy. Snoke has no throne world, and has not rooted the First Order to a single planet that serves as its capital. Instead, he prefers to rule from within the safety of the Supremacy, staying ever mobile, and maneuvering First Order agents onto countless worlds. Though Starkiller Base represented a sizable concentration of First Order power, Snoke's preparations meant that its destructions did not set back the regime's plans. Snoke managed to conceal the Supremacy in the Unknown Regions, masking its immense sensor signature by hiding it in close proximity to highly energetic stars. So that is the answer of Snoke's whereabouts in the events before he revealed himself and attacked the Resistance in The Last Jedi, and also how Snoke hid himself by using stars as well as keeping mobile and never staying in one location for too long. But leave in the comments down below what you think of this method for Snoke's survival and how he was able to stay away from the prying eyes of the Resistance and the Jedi for so long. And as a big question, what else do you think lies in unknown space that we are all waiting to uncover in future Star Wars installments. If you haven't entered the lightsaber giveaway, feel free to do so. All you have to do to enter is like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, and post in the comments which lightsaber you hope to win. If you have a future video suggestion, also feel free to leave that in the comments down below as I go through them and often pick from the comment section. If you would like to interact with me directly, you can follow me on Twitter, at StupendousWave. Thank you as always so much for watching, may the force be with you, and have a great day.